Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's OpDestroy guys. Today I'm going to take on Dr. T Tropical Island. Uh, stupid me, I forgot to take on Hammerman Attack Zoo event yesterday, so I didn't get a chance to get any of his resources or prototype uh, modules or anything. Kind of bummed out. This morning when I woke up, I'm like, dang it, I have New Zealand time. I I've already had him and uh, he's gone, long gone already. So shucks for me um anyways guys to dr t speed run guys i am going against a head my head to head against myself to beat my own time um i don't know if this is gonna work but if you guys look at i did a test run with uh with warriors with the boat of warriors and sergeant brick with her battle orders and i noticed that if you um if you uh if you put the battle orders uh and you activate that under the smoke once she gets out of the smoke, she'll actually, it'll work. And then I, I figured re-smoke her so she doesn't get targeted and let's see if her battle orders is still on. As you can see here, um, the mortar was ready to target her, but I re-smoked her. But if you look at her battle orders, guys, it's still going strong while she's under the smoke. So it got me thinking that she might actually work with the warriors after all, guys. So I just wanted to show you that. I wanted to test it out to see if it worked. And now I'm going to use that strategy on the Dr. T speedrun. Um, yes, I'm going to have to be very quick in thinking and to re-smoke her and everything like that, but I think if I if I can do that, uh, it's going to be awesome and we can take this base down and hopefully get a new record time, guys. So um, so there we go. Got all our warriors loaded up and we got all our beautiful statues boosted. I even got the Power Stone chance uh, boosted as well. So uh, I plan to clear my map afterwards, but that'll be a separate video. I'm going to actually clear my map, guys, with the Smoky Hookah and then clear my NPC bases with the uh, Gren Medic Tank strategy because I don't normally lose troops using that troop method. So... Uh, join me for that guys. That's gonna be a fun fun episode and probably a long one too if I'm clearing my map So anyways guys, so let's without let's without making this video super duper long Let's go in here and what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna be speaking guys as I attack that way It throws off my concentration and, and I'd like to try to do this and focus on this directly without actually so I'm sorry if I don't commentate um, Enjoy the green screen background uh, cool stuff that you see and um, I'll let the music kind of drift up a little bit as I'm as I'm tacking so you don't uh, hear nothing <laughs> Okay, or as a matter of fact, you just might actually uh, just hear the actual uh, Boom Beach gameplay. So there we go guys We all know the rules are the time will start as soon as I hit the attack button and the uh, the time will stop once HQ 7 um, Stage 7 does detonate so I will keep a close eye on that and um, we will see okay guys, so um all right, so I'm gonna be quiet now and focus on this and the time will start when I hit the attack button, okay? All right guys, here we go. Super happy about that one, but uh, we got it. Thank <laughs> you. 
Boom, stage five, down. I think I'm gonna reload my troops for stage six though, you guys. Got brick. Ah, oh, dang it. Got it, but that was super duper 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 close and slow. Oh, what a shame. Alright. Guys, guys, and gals, um, I, I don't, the exact time will show up on the screen, but I did a, I did an actual stopwatch, and I don't know if I actually documented it correctly to the pinpoint of hundreds of a second, but I believe it was 3 minutes and 23 seconds, guys, my record's 316, so it was a 7 second difference, and I blew it on stage 6 for sure, guys, I know I could have saved over that many seconds, uh, to, 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 to be close or actually clinch my record um, I, uh, I'm, I'm like darn it I didn't take care of mines as you guys saw and I don't have a troop health statue guys so my warriors and my troops die a lot quicker they, when they take on more damage or mines or any firepower they do perish quicker so that's also a fault that I have and but the mines I didn't take care of there was a shock mine I threw critter box but I, did, I didn't get it too far enough to the right to actually get the, the shock mine but you could see in stage six that uh, it was a, it was bad um, this it did go down but it didn't it didn't work out in the end and I I, I this could have been a, 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 a clincher guys this could have been a new record had I not botched it so bad on stage six um, stage seven was kind of if if it was it went down quicker than stage uh, six did it was just stage six just uh there was just it was just a mess i i i got shocked by the shock launcher at the end and it prevented my warriors and i just i just lost a lot of warriors too guys so i almost had it guys and i will keep trying because i will do it i will promise you i do it and as far as my uh sergeant brick i never got to do the battle orders it, it's such a quick quick game guys that you don't actually have time to really think about it you're worried about your warriors being smoked properly then you're thinking about shocking the, the defenses because you don't want to smoke the hq and I, I didn't take it into account but as we, as we know now um you can use sergeant brick with warriors if you uh you actually activate her after the smoke and you you can re-smoke her again and then the battle orders will still be active so no that's a good good little good little nugget of knowledge right there and information from boom beach uh, that you can do so guys that's gonna be it join me again soon because i'm gonna make another video of me clearing my map and um we'll uh we'll take it there and we'll get it done okay guys thanks again for watching we'll see you guys soon bye